Hi everybody, this is Oleg. Welcome to Orion Preparedness. In this video, I want to talk to you about SHTF weapons. And uh, the other day, yesterday, in fact, I was watching New York, New York Preppers video, Tactical versus Practical, and that inspired me to talk about these SHTF weapons and uh, put my two cents in. I'm no expert by any means when it comes to weapons. I do like guns and other types of weapons, but I'm still novice at it. I've been shooting for, for a long time, for many years. Still, you know, there's many people with far better knowledge than I possess. Anyway, here is my, here is my two cents, here is my view. While you definitely need good hunting rifle, and a good sidearm and a shotgun and the list goes on you know maybe assault weapon assault rifle you know there's no end there are so many purposes and reasons I think other types of weapons are very essential in this HTF I don't want to say more essential or and or more important but they are uh, they are important and uh, one of those would be 1022 rifle, just basic 1022 Ruger rifle. It's a lot quieter than any of the shotgun sidearms, 308s, hunting rifles. It's and if you put two liter Coke bottle on it, it will be it'll act as a suppressor, so uh, it'll be totally quiet. And with 1022, you can. You can kill a deer if you place your shot right. If you can kill small game, definitely, you know, squirrels, rabbits, some birds. So, uh, in my opinion, that's a must have rifle if you are a prepper. And then, a couple other items I want to talk to you about in this video is um, even more types of rifle that some of you may not agree with me but I think they have place in preparedness one of them is good quality air rifle some good air rifle they're not cheap either they're they will run you five six hundred dollars with a scope and everything but uh, they are quiet and with an air rifle you can effectively kill small game very quietly quiet is what you want in a SHTF scenario. Another weapon that I think every prepper should have and for the good quality one you will pay top dollar is crossbow. Crossbows they really high quality good ones they will run you like the Excalibur for an example they will run you up to eighteen hundred dollars but there is nothing that you cannot kill with that. You can kill buffalo with it. You can kill anything. You'll kill a bear with it, an elk, anything. And it is pretty much silent. Especially compared, compared to the guns. So, in my opinion, I think uh, as preppers, we should have good quality sidearm some good revolver of your choice you know I like 357 it's perfect around in my opinion it's heavy enough it's uh, it's not too heavy yet it's heavy enough if you place your shot right you can kill a bear with it and you'll definitely stop a human with that you know you should have a really decent hunting or hunting rifle you should have shotgun. If you can afford all these things, you should have a assault rifle, you know, an AK or AR. Uh, however, in my opinion, if you're if you're new to guns, if you're new, even if you're not new, you should have really good quality air rifle, and you should have crossbow because that will provide meal on your table when crap hits the fan in a hard way 
and it's going to be quiet. And you should have Ruger 1022. It's a little bit louder than air rifle, air gun, but it's much quieter than the others. And you can do a lot with it as well. So hopefully you find this video useful. Uh, check out New York's Prepper video, tactical versus practical. It's very useful, very good information. Uh, like this video if you like it um, and share it if you find it useful. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next upload. Take care.